It's our opportunity and pleasure to feature the wellness of you with Fatima Gamble. Today, we're going to talk about alone versus loneliness. Is it okay for us to be alone, Fatima? Oh, absolutely. It's an opportunity for us to reflect on ourselves and also to just to still ourselves because we live in a, in a hectic society, a hectic environment with work and children and we spend time uh, taking care of others and we don't take the time for ourselves. So being alone is an opportunity to care for self. You know, I don't didn't think about that automatically. I thought like, okay, being alone, you're alone, you're alone, but you do need that time for yourself. And um, what can we do while we are alone? What would you suggest? Oh, absolutely nothing. <laughs> or <laughs> whatever, good... <laughs> whatever you choose to do. Yes. Or you can uh, y utilize that time to... Um, to be active, to, I, I think um, some time ago we spoke about clutter. Yes. And clean your closets, clean out that drawer that has um, your junk drawer. You know, you can do things around the house that uh, will keep you active and keep you occupied. Now, loneliness, when does that set in? The point of where you where there is loneliness, and what is loneliness? Well, loneliness um, is when you're not okay with being with yourself. Yeah. You're not okay with yourself. And if you're okay with yourself, you're not lonely. You may be alone, but you're not lonely. So, you know. That's very interesting. Now, how can we avoid the feeling or even the state of, of loneliness? Would you say have a hobby or occupy yourself? or? Well, you could um, pray on it. Yes. Meditate. Yes. Tap into your higher power. Yes. Because you're never alone. Yeah. Never. You are never alone. Fatima, when does loneliness set in? Well, when you are not okay with being alone. And you can be alone, but not lonely. But then you can always find something to occupy yourself. But then again, if you had been in a relationship and that relationship is no longer uh, a part of your life, and you spent a lot of time with that individual, then naturally you're going to miss the time that you spent with that individual, and you're going to feel a sense of loneliness. But if you take the time to occupy yourself with other things, then um, I think that uh, you can take that time also to reinvent yourself and to, uh, to, to, to stimulate interest in other things.